Mal Harris, Garbage Man Piper, <clears throat> coming to you from the studio, my patio. Well, Sunday morning, we've been getting rain off and on through last night, and it has made it nice out in the studio today. Was in the studio almost all day yesterday, doing some work. I... I'm going to be taking and putting cedar all through here like I've already done there and like I've already done there. So I still got some work that I'm doing in the studio. So this is a continuation of uh, my pipes series with a twist because the pipes I'm showing today are for sale. Now, I've got two individuals that have specifically requested that I show them uh, the Punto Oros, and I'm talking months ago. So by the time this airs, um, some of these pipes may be available and some may not, but this is not necessarily a selling pipe video as much as sharing my, uh, my pipes. So um, what's got me thinking about selling these pipes? Uh, they're not nine millimeter pipes. I am smoking my Savinelli Spring that I have modified from a six millimeter to a nine millimeter. And this came by way of Artie's place. Art, thank you, brother. Much love, bro. And I am using my bearded tamper. Tamper? Sorry, Art. I got to fill up the other one with uh, fluid. And I am smoking McClellan's 5100 red cake that I got from Olberg. Thank you, Olberg. So let's get to it. I've got eight pipes. So these eight pipes that I share will go along with, I believe, we ended up at 42 pipes so far. Yeah, right, we're right at 42 pipes so far. So this will round us off at 50% of my pipes once this airs. So the first one is an autograph, Savinelli Autograph Zulu, non-filtered pipe. Oh, I probably paid $135 for this pipe. Um, I have never smoked it. It is an estate sale pipe. It has been smoked, it's been cleaned, but I've never smoked it. It is a very, it's, it's a nice solid pipe. Zulu autograph. Uh, no chatter at all. Maybe just one little mark underneath, nothing heavy duty. So nice little pipe. Um, I'm selling that pipe for a hundred bucks. So, if somebody's interested in that pipe, it'll go for a hundred bucks. The next one is um, one of the more, I, I don't know, I, I dig this pipe. Uh, I bought it just because I, I loved it, but it's not a nine mil. I got to let it go. It is another autograph. It's an author shape, six millimeter. Never been smoked. It is new. Um, the box looks a little, the, um, I'll tell you which ones have all their stuff with it and which ones don't. This one doesn't have anything with it. I think it came with a pipe sock. This next one came with the sleeve, a box, and all the fixings. And it's a pretty, pretty pipe. It is a six millimeter pipe. Savinelli autograph and you can see the bowl is just virgin 
gorgeous, gorgeous pipe. I really like this pipe, but it's not a nine mil, so I'm not gonna chooch it up. Uh, and like I said, it's got the box and everything. I paid 235 for that pipe. I'm looking for 200 bucks. So another one is another estate sale pipe. Again, if uh, all of these but this pipe are either autograph or Punto Oro's, and I'll let you know. So this is a Punto Oro. It's a Punto Oro. It is a 111 king size. It is, it, this was um, sold by Neiman Marcus. It comes with a pipe sock, a Punto Oro pipe sock. Uh, it is a uh, non-filtered pipe. Nice pipe. It has been smoked. I have never smoked it. It's clean. I paid 135 for this pipe, and I'm letting it go for a hundred bucks. Uh, I think. Uh, if I don't ever sell this pipe, I'll be good with it. Um, it's probably something I would never smoke, but um, it is different, and difference good. So there you go. You got a Punto Oro Gold Zulu, shape 904 KS. It is a non-filtered pipe. Oh, I'm sorry, it's a six mil pipe. I had it as non-filtered. So it's a six mil balsa, which is surprising. It's pretty thin through here. Cool pipe, nice pipe, light pipe. Very nice. And all of these have just tremendous ring grain on them. The sandblasting to these is to the Punto Oro standard. I don't buy crappy pipes. So, Zulu shape, 904, Savinelli Punto Oro Gold, never been smoked. I paid right at, what did I pay? Oh, I don't have down what I paid. I went online, this pipe right now is going for 166. I'll sell this pipe for 150. I paid more than that back. I, I bought all of these January and February of this year. I was just on a tear. It's just what I do. So anyways, next one is going to be Punto Oro Author Shape 321. It is a six mil balsa. It has its box, it has its um, sock and all the paperwork with it. Again, all of these, I'm just be repeating myself, beautiful ring grain, the sandblast is nice. It's a, three, a 321. I'm letting this one go. I probably paid 168 probably for it. I'm letting it go for, uh, 150 as well. The next one, Punto Oro Gold, never been smoked. It is a 207. Again, the ring grain on these are crazy. It is a six mil balsa. All of these pipes range about the same price. This one's this one here. Um, I'm gonna let go for 120. Really nice, lightweight pipe, gorgeous pipe. It's not uh, the gold on the inside. It has got a coat on it, but it is marked as a Punto Oro gold. The next one, I'm, I'm having a very hard time uh, getting rid of that because it's the shape that I like. I am really hoping, matter of fact, probably the only pipe I will buy 
is a 602 or a 622 Punta Oro. I probably won't buy any other pipes once these are gone. Um, never been smoked. Sweet again. Just beautiful ring grain. It is a 9 mil balsa. Gorgeous pipe. Love it. Would love to keep it in my 602 collection. And worst case scenario, hey, maybe I'll do that. Um, that pipe's going for um, 150. I paid close to 170 for a lot of these Punta Oros. The next one is a, and it has its box and all the information. The next one is a Punto Oro Gold 315 Prince shape. Again, crazy ring grain sandblast. This one is a six mil balsa. Never been smoked. Just another gorgeous pipe. I'm wanting 150 for this pipe. So I, let me do this. Let me flip the uh, camera over and I'll just go through these again uh, and give you guys the pricing on these pipes so that there are no confusion. There is no confusion. So let me flip this. Okay, so this is the, um, the autograph Zulu shape that I'm asking 100 for. This is the autograph author that I just love this dang pipe. Six millimeter, I'm asking 200 for this pipe. This is the Estate Neiman Marcus non-filtered pipe. I think it was, I think we did see it did have a filter. I'll have to look again. $100 for that pipe. And then we've got the um, Punto Oro Gold 904 Zulu shape. We've got the 321 autograph. We've got the 207, not autograph, Punto Oro. That is not an autograph. 321 Punto Oro. 207 Punta Oro. I'm asking 150, and um, I think this one was 120 on the 207. I got the 602 for 150, and the 315 for 150. All right, well, there you go. Some of these may be gone by the time I air this. I will get this out to two other folks who were requesting that I do this video. That makes us 50 pipes in my pipe series. <clears throat> All right, so we're back. Um, I am open to doing a trade. Um, if it is a Punto Oro, Punto Oro gold pipe, nine millimeter, 602 or a 626. Those are really the only pipes that I am interested in trading for unless this pipe right here, this autograph, unless you can get me one of these in a 9mm. I love that shape and that, that pipe. I just love, I don't know, I just fell in love with this pipe. So, uh, won't be heartbroken if none of them sell, to be honest with you. We'll just put them back in the collection. But... Uh, I know I've had some interest of people who are interested looking for certain pipes that I may have in Punto Oro or autographs. Well, there you go. Mel Harris, Garbage Man Piper, sweet chicken baby. Y'all have a wonderful rest of your Sunday and be safe out there.